so this video that I'm making right now, it's um, a little tip, or whatever you want to call it, tip or trick. So it's just about the beeping sound when you open your door. And uh, if you want to keep your um, doors open without the beeping sound beeping. So there's the sound right here. Just say if, you're, if you have your um, your car on and you're listening to music, what you want to do is first open your door, then, then, then put your key, open your door, then put your key in, and turn the key forward, and listen to your music without that beeping sound in the background. Or just remove your key, like right now, just remove your key and just put it back in there, and the the, the sound will go will go off. But if you open another door, the the sound will start beeping again. So, just a I guess a tip. Just put your key in first. Open your doors first, then put your key in your, in the ignition and turn it forward to listen to your music. It's if you're cleaning your car or something, or you don't want to hear that. That let me see. Let me do that noise again real quick. Let's see. Let's see. Hmm. I guess it stopped working. It's pretty cool. So I just say we have my key forward. Let me turn on this music. Can't have music on my videos. Well. You know what I'm trying to say, so if you, if you have a car like mine, just this um, little beeping sound that comes on, so there we go. So just to get rid of that beeping sound. So just take your key out of the ignition, take it out, then when you're done just put it back in, turn the key forward and listen to your music. But um, eventually the sound will shut off, like after like I think a minute or something, the sound will shut off automatically. But it's unless you want to wait a minute to have that sound shut off. Okay, so thank you for watching, and give my videos thumbs up and subscribe for future videos. Got a lot of videos on my list right now, and um, yep, that's about it. Thank you.